Your Volvo holiday sales event. Right now, lease your Volvo S60 T5 for $399 a month and pay nothing at signing. Presented by Toyota, we'll sit down with Coach Turgeon's former head coach, Hall of Famer Larry Brown. As Coach spent a couple of days with the Terrapins, we'll also go all access and take a look at the Terp Strength and Conditioning Program and the new Performance Center. And head coach Mark Turgeon will join us to preview the upcoming schedule as the Terps get closer to ACC play. This special holiday edition of Inside Maryland Basketball, presented by Toyota, starts now. Maryland's a special place, and that's why I'm here. That's better. It looks like a team, guys. Hi everybody, I'm Johnny Holiday. Welcome to our special holiday edition of Inside Maryland Basketball presented by Toyota. Great to have you with us today. Recently here on campus, we had a visit from Hall of Fame coach Larry Brown. Yes, the same Larry Brown that coached Mark Turgeon when he played at Kansas. He had a chance to visit with the Terrapin players, look around campus. We caught up with him and had a chance to talk about his former point guard at Kansas, Mark Turgeon. Let's take a look. All right, fist out. Fist out. There's so many things that go into being a good coach. And Mark, I think, has, has got the total package. But uh, it's what you do in practice. It's the preparation every single day, trying to coach your players up, that I really think makes Mark great. Everything that they might encounter in a game, I think Mark prepares them for those situations in practice. Hold up. Guys, can we run our stuff? Can we run our stuff? Guys, I've seen it work. I've seen it win a national championship. Every, I've seen it go Final Fours, League Championships. Coming and watching them practice, watching them coach, be successful in a sport that we all love, doesn't get any better than that. It meant a lot to me that he was here. Um, I think it meant a lot to the players and that he showed that he truly cared about them. Nice to see. I think if he had stayed another day, he would have had a whistle and been out of half court with me. And, uh, but he can watch my system and then write things down and make it better. So I'm already a better coach this week because of having him here two days last week. Yeah. Now, let's go. Come on, everybody in. Come on, guys. He's won everywhere he's been. It hasn't always been easy. You know, he's always had to, you know, overcome a lot of challenges. But I, th I think the people here, um, what they can count on is they'll have a team that'll execute down the stretch, you know, that'll try to defend every possession, that'll play unselfish. He'll have good character kids and the people will recognize they're getting better on a daily basis. And it's not an accident. It's because the guy has a rare gift to teach. Now you can't get away with this. It's either a high pass or a bounce pass, right? You know, to come and watch me coach kind of validated what he already believed, that I do know what I'm doing. I'm doing a lot of things that he taught me. No, I knew a little bit about basketball when I got to college. thought I knew everything, but I learned a lot uh, from him. And uh, probably just to be a teacher. You know, they call us coach, but we're really teachers. You know, he always used to call himself that, and I didn't understand it until I became a, a teacher slash coach, and that's probably what really has taught me the most. And be right here when he catches it. Got it? Sub in. Let's go. Sub There's no secret in being successful. You got to know your sport. You got to be able to teach. You got to be able to recruit. Um, you got to make kids want to play for you. Um, and I think Mark does that. And at a school like Maryland, you have all those opportunities. Okay, so here's what I want to do. If Sean takes it out, okay, and he throws it to me, Sean's going to stay behind the press. Nick, you just stay middle. All right, and then we're just, we'll run our soft press offense. We'll bring it up, try to make two guys guard us. Okay, if I had two, I throw back. You stay in the middle. Okay, we'll, we'll do our soft press offense. I'm excited. You know, I'm, I grew up in the ACC, being at Carolina, coaching there and playing for unbelievable people. I know how good this conference is, but I've always felt Maryland was just a special place, and I, I think they got a special coach. You know, I've been with Mark a long time, and uh, 
it's there's no accidents when teams win. You know, generally when teams win, they defend their ass off. They rebound the ball. They get every loose ball. They share the ball. They do what they do best. You know, watching you guys and how you're attentive and how you want to get better, it's what our game's all about. So, uh, you get some good grades. Let me tell you, I hated this guy when I played for him. And I love him now. Coach, appreciate it. Thanks Thank for coming. You. Uh, you're always welcome. Everybody in the back. Family on three. One, two, three. Family. When our special holiday edition of Inside Maryland Basketball, presented by Toyota Returns, a fan gets the chance to ask a question for Coach Turgeon. Stay with us. Inside Maryland Basketball is presented by Toyota Moving Forward and Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union, partnering for financial success. 33 years ago, we had a simple idea. Make the best vehicles in America and once a year offer them with special savings. Today, it's a phenomenon. Toyota Thon is back with incredible deals on a full selection of new Toyotas. Like RAV4, get 0% APR financing or lease for only $189 a month with an additional $500 in Toyota lease cash. Plus, now every new Toyota comes with Toyota Care. Others have tried to copy it, but in the end, there's only one Toyota Thon. The biggest and best sales event of the year is going on now. I've learned a lot from West Foster over the years, but the most important thing I've learned is how you treat people. Long and Foster was founded on the bedrock of honesty and integrity. Those are the qualities I've always seen in Craig Northrup. Hi, I'm Craig Northrup, president of the Northrup team of Long and Foster Real Estate. We are honored to have earned the number one team in the nation for all brokerages. There's only one number one in the United States, and that's the Craig Northrup team. The Terrapin Club provides scholarship support to hundreds of outstanding Maryland student athletes so they may go on to be champions in many different fields. My name is Len, and I'm a champion. To fulfill the dreams of today's student athletes, we ask you to join the Terrapin Club and support those who represent the Terrapins with pride. Help the Terrapin Club continue their vital educational support of Maryland's outstanding student athletes. Join us because scholarships build champions. Don't miss a moment of Maryland basketball. Take advantage of our five-game flex plans on sale now. Guarantee your seat for the Duke or North Carolina game by selecting five exciting games, including two additional ACC matchups and two non-conference games. Prices start as low as $185. Only a limited number of flex plans are available, so visit umterps.com or call 1-800-IMA-TERP to order your tickets today. Maryland basketball. Fear the turtle. This portion of Inside Maryland Basketball is presented by Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union, partnering for financial success. Today's sports calendar brought to you by BWI Thurgood Marshall Airport, your easy come, easy go airport. It's time for Keys to a Healthier Living, brought to you by United Healthcare. This week's tip is post-workout nutrition. It's crucial for our athletes to recover from a hard workout or hard lift and prepare for the demands of the next day. Typically, after we finish our workouts, we'll give them a carb-protein drink in about a three-to-one ratio uh, to prevent muscle breakdown, enhance recovery, and give them an opportunity to be successful. It's time to Ask Coach Turgeon, brought to you by the University of Maryland Medical System. I'm Eric Garman from New York City. Coach Turgeon, since you moved here over the summer, have you had any time to sightsee in the D.C. Baltimore area? Thanks for your question. Uh, unfortunately, I haven't had much time. I was lucky enough to take my mom uh, by the White House uh, with my kids when we first moved here. We went to the, the Washington, D.C. Zoo, which was a lot of fun. Um, but recruiting and, and getting this team right has been more important for me right now. But I'm really looking forward to the offseason and spent a lot of time in D.C., Baltimore, Annapolis, and getting to know Maryland uh, area a lot better and really looking forward to it. Thanks for your question. When our special holiday edition of Inside Maryland Basketball, presented by Toyota Returns, will go all access with the Terps Strength and Conditioning Program and go inside the new performance center that the Terps unveil this fall. We're coming right back. I've learned a lot from West Foster over the years, but the most important thing I've learned is how you treat people. 
Long & Foster was founded on the bedrock of honesty and integrity. Those are the qualities I've always seen in Craig Northup. Hi, I'm Craig Northup, president of the Northup team of Long & Foster Real Estate. We are honored to have earned the number one team in the nation for all brokerages. There's only one number one in the United States, and that's the Craig Northup team. Do you love these words? Especially free? You're going to get a whole lot of free at Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union. Think of us as your financial resource with benefits, real benefits, including free direct deposit, free debit card, free online loan applications, free online check copies. For our community's financial well-being, Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union offers a full range of financial services, making it easier for members to save and borrow at the free reasonable rates. We're nonprofit and have funds to lend. For more information, call us at 301-627-2666 or visit our website. We're not fee-driven, we're free-driven. Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union, one of many great reasons for living local in Prince George's County. A beautiful steering wheel is great, but only if the dash it's attached to is equally beautiful. So we made sure it was. But what's the point of a beautiful dash if the seats aren't beautiful too? But we couldn't stop there, so we kept going. And before we knew it, we had a 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Our country's brave soldiers give their all each and every day. This season, through the Hoops for Heroes program, each three-pointer scored by the Terps means a $100 donation to the USO of Metropolitan Washington, thanks to the Craig Northrop team of Long & Foster Real Estate. USO Metro is dedicated to serving those who serve and their families in the metropolitan area. So let's hear it, Terp fans, because each three-pointer means that much more. Track our progress on umterps.com, USO Metro. This portion of Inside Maryland Basketball is presented by MetaFast. Visit MetaFastTerps.com. Welcome back to Inside Maryland Basketball, our special holiday edition presented by Toyota. I'm Johnny Holiday. Terrific to have you with us. This past fall, the Terrapins unveiled this brand new basketball performance center. It's a beautiful state-of-the-art facility designed to give the Terrapin players all the whistles and bells they need to be the best they can be inside this room, to be the best they can be on the floor at Comcast. Let's go all access now with the Maryland strength and conditioning staff. kind of deem ourselves basketball performance, you know, beyond the scope of just strength conditioning. And I need to make us perform better in, in Coach Turgeon's system and what he wants to accomplish. I want my athletes to move clean, move efficient, move well, and not waste a ton of energy, you know, with their movement. And I think that's cumulative. I think that adds up to where you get to the end of the game and you haven't expended as much energy as, as your opponent, you know, you can push through. You know, everybody's got that point where, where they're going to give up. You know, and, and we train and we work to make sure that, that the opposition is the one that gives up first. You know, that's, that's really what it's about. Everything he's trying to do, he's trying to make us better. And, you know, late down the game sometimes, I don't even feel like I'm tired at all. There's definitely a big difference from uh, high school to now. I put on about 15 pounds of muscle now, but uh, that definitely helped a lot. You know, my movement on the court is better, uh, footwork, and uh, just being more consistent. Keeping it interesting is crucial. So our ability to, to be very specific to the game, I think the guys love it. They feed off it. And you definitely try to relate everything back to basketball. You know, every, every movement, everything we do, you know, is because, you know, it's something on the court that we have to do and get better at. So that's definitely, you know, what makes it fun. My training philosophy is it emphasizes movement and, and authentic movement. So we needed the space, we needed the tools, needed something to, to accommodate you know, the, the size and, and the movement patterns, you know, of our, of our players. This new 
Purdue Basketball Performance Center was the vision of Gary Williams and his staff. And when Coach Turgeon came in, you know, he pushed to make the project a reality. All of the donations to this project were from private funds. You know, people as high as, you know, $65,000 to people donating $50. But it was something that, that we needed to do uh, to give our, our program an opportunity to continue to, to compete at the, the national stage. When they first told me we about to have weight room right off the court, I was like, that would be nice. You know, all the top programs that I see have a nice uh, training facility. This is for basketball, designed for basketball, and, and basketball is the only, the only sports that have access to it. Moving down here has, has been mind-blowing for us. It's opened a whole world of, of possibilities of how we can engage our players and, and, and attack limiting factors uh, to make them better. Got it? Okay, black here, red's there. Let's get this thing going right away. Let's go. Let's go. The game provides a lot of basketball mechanics, and down here we have a lot more room to just move around and get after it as a team. I'm learning a lot of new stuff that I've never seen before. Uh, the basketball goal, you know, that definitely is a big help before games where we can warm up in here, things like that. But, you know, the new equipment and things is just, just very helpful. Probably the most important thing is, is we're, not, we're not fighting for time. The former facility, we were split among 25 sports. So having our own space where we didn't have to go through scheduling, if I wanted to bring one guy in on his own, you know, whether it's Alex or Sean or whoever it is, to work on specific points of their game or their body, um, I have the freedom to do that. You know, Coach Turgeon mentioned in his press conference when he got here that player development was crucial to what he does. Um, I think this gives us a great outlet to develop the players that we have. From a recruiting standpoint, you know, we're right on par with, with everyone in the ACC and other programs in the country in terms of having access to the technology to make our players better. A lot of people from a lot of different backgrounds stepped up uh, to, to get this done, you know, so, so, I mean, this is the result. This is what it's about. When we come back after a couple of messages, Coach Turgeon will join us and we'll get a chance to chat with the coach. We're coming right back. The Terrapin Club provides scholarship support to hundreds of outstanding Maryland student athletes so they may go on to be champions in many different fields. My name is Kevin and I am a champion. To fulfill the dreams of today's student athletes, we ask you to join the Terrapin Club and support those who represent the Terrapins with pride. Because you never know, some of us might go on to build the next great performance athletic brand. Help the Terrapin Club support our student athletes with vital education support. Join the Terrapin Club today. 33 years ago, our goal was simple. Build the best vehicles and once a year offer them with special savings. Today, it's an American tradition. Toyota Thon is back with a huge selection of fuel saving Toyotas. Now's the time to lease a Prius for only $219 a month or get 0% APR financing for five years. Plus, now every new Toyota comes with Toyota Care. Others have tried to copy it, but in the end, there's only one Toyota Thon. The biggest and best sales event of the year is going on now. Do you love these words? Especially free? You're going to get a whole lot of free at Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union. Think of us as your financial resource with benefits, real benefits, including free direct deposit, free debit card, free online loan applications, free online check copies. For our community's financial well-being, Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union offers a full range of financial services, making it easier for members to save and borrow at the free reasonable rates. We're nonprofit and have funds to lend. For more information, call us at 301-627-2666 or visit our website. We're not fee-driven, we're free-driven. Prince George's Community Federal Credit Union, one of many great reasons for living local in Prince George's County. This portion of Inside Maryland Basketball is presented by Toyota, moving forward. Be with us for the next episode of Inside Maryland Basketball on Sunday, January 8th, 9.30 a.m. on Comcast Sportsnet. And the show is always available online via Terps TV at umterps.com. 
Welcome back, everybody, to our special holiday edition of Inside Maryland Basketball, presented by Toyota. Johnny Holiday, joined by Maryland's head coach, Mark Turgeon. Coach, you got your sixth one of the year against FIU the other night. A pretty tough ball game. Uh, did you expect them to be that good? Another blowout for us, Johnny. We, we, we like people to leave early from the games. No, it was, uh, I expect it to be a tough game for us. Everything's tough for us right now. I thought FIU played well. Uh, we had stage fright in the first half. We didn't play anywhere like we've been practicing. And so the halftime speech was just go out and play. Pretend you're at the park, just play hard, do what we've been practicing. And we were much better in the second half. And you came from 11 points down to win that ball game, 65-61. Terrell Stoglin, 20 points in the game, in foul trouble most of the game. In foul trouble a lot, yeah. And I didn't realize we were down 11. Um, but we never panicked, that's what I liked. Terrell picked up his fourth bonehead play by me. I should have taken him out with three. Um, he doesn't like to play a lot of defense, so I didn't think he'd foul again, Johnny, to be quite honest with you, but he did. It was great for our team. He was hurt that week of practice, didn't practice a lot, so we got used to playing without him. I thought defensively we really stepped up when he was out of the game, and that was the difference in the game. And it's got to be a confidence builder for the other guys to realize they can make that move. They can win a game without your number one scorer on the bench. Rebound inside Paget. Nice strong rebound, and the putback goes in. Pass goes to Parker. Drives strong to the basket and lays it in. We gained a lot of confidence, and we did it at the defensive end. We've really been working hard defensively. Blocked away by Mosley. For us to do it on the defensive end to win that game, because that's really what the difference was, what was big for us. And yeah, it gave the guys confidence to do it without Terrell. Ashton Pankey, tough kid, stitches in the first half, come back to score 11 of 13 points in the second half. I'm glad you said he was tough, because I said he was soft. I bit through my lip and never went and got stitches <laughs> till after the game. And he, he, he was out for the whole first half, which I thought hurt us a lot uh, in the first half. And he gave us great minutes in the second half. He did a great job on the Ferguson kid, held him three for 16 or 15 right. from the field. That kid was a, a top 50 player coming out of high school. Loose ball picked up by Allen, bounce pass on the baseline. Pankey with another block and a foul called on Florida International. Ashton just keeps getting better. Uh, made a big play, a uh, couple block shots, made two free throws down the stretch for us. So I, I was really proud of Ashton. And Sean Mosley in that game against FIU, he played extremely well. Didn't score a lot of points, but got double figures for you. Yeah, and he just does so many things. Loose ball is picked up by Taylor. Phil so Taylor the other way, blocked by Mosley. Yeah, he's, he's a master at coming from behind and blocking shots, isn't he? Pinning them on the backboard, and he, he hustle, hustle plays and great leadership. Uh, really happy for Sean and... and uh, you know, in the end, it was a really good win for our team. Cutting to the bucket, bobbles the ball, picks it up, fall away, eight-footer. It's good, and he's fouled. Free throw shooting, 22 of 32. Not bad. Can not, get better, though, can Not bad for us. <laughs> right. Now, most of that's Terrell. I think Terrell was 11 for 13 at the line, and uh, when we talked about that as a team uh, this week in practice. We have to get better individually. Uh, we just can't rely on Terrell to make free throws. And, you know, but we had two big free throw offense plays. Ashton had a, a second chance bas basket on a missed free throw. Then Sean made them tip the ball out of bounds late just by being aggressive on offensive rebounding. And this being the holiday season, the, the students are away, but the basketball players are here and they continue to work. They work hard, Johnny, and, and unfortunately for them, I played for a guy where we practiced twice a day over Christmas break when we had the chance, so we're going to do that quite a bit and uh, shorten the practices by hour and 15 in the morning, hour and 15 or 30 in the afternoon, and really break it down and get better, and, and they've been working extremely hard. Um, we are getting so much better in practice. It hasn't translated to the games yet, but hopefully it will soon. What are a couple of concerns you'd like to kind of hone in on over the holidays in these practices? Well, we're going to continue to defend and rebound. That's mm -hmm. the whole thing for us. And, um, you know, offensive, our execution has to get better. And, and then we, we can't have the, what we call game slippage. When you're practicing at a high level and then you get into a game and you play way below that level, it's got to be a little bit of slippage there. Um, when coach can't control and if we can get better at that we're going to be a pretty good team and coach i think every maryland basketball fan like the coaching staff anticipating the return of Pishon howard and alex lynn yeah uh Pichon's practicing for us now so hopefully he's going to be a part you know no setbacks he'll be a part of our future uh, uh he's been practicing well and then alex is the 28th and he has really been practicing well i'm excited We've put them both with the first team, and, and it's, it's really helping us, and we look forward to having them. And you've got some more non-conference games before the conference schedule starts January 8th at NC State. 
Yeah, and uh, we have we have three games at uh, at home, which will be nice. Uh, get a lot of uh, practice in, a lot of game type situations. We'll have to play different lineups, and you know it'll be a good a setup uh, as we prepare for the league. Coach, always great to be with you. Happy holidays to you and the family. All right, thanks, John. And thanks so much for joining us here for Inside Maryland Basketball. As we say goodbye, we have a special holiday winter wonderland performance just for you. Sleigh bells ring. Are you listening? In the lane, snow is glistening. A beautiful sight, we're happy tonight. Walking in the winter wonderland. Going away is the blue bird. Here to stay is a new bird. He sings a love song as we go along. Walking in the winter wonderland. In the meadow we can build a snowman. Then pretend that he is Parson Brown. He'll say, are you merry? We'll say no man. But you can do the job when you're in town. Later on, we'll conspire as we dream by the fire to face unafraid the plans that we made. In the meadow, we could build a snowman and pretend that he's a circus clown. We'll have lots of fun with Mr. Snowman until the other kids knock him down. When it snows, ain't it thrilling? Though your nose gets a chillin'. We'll frolic and play the Eskimo way. Walking in the winter wonderland. Walking in the winter wonderland. Walking in the winter wonderland. From our basketball family to your family, I hope you have a great holiday season and a happy new year. Go Terps! Uh. Oh, now? <clears throat> Need some water, man. <laughs> are you pronouncing the T or are you saying like winter? Yeah, that's it. Walking in a winter wonderland. Winter. Okay. So winter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Winter. Right. Hold on, Tay. Let's just wait. Let's go like this. Lot, you and I should go like this. Yeah. Because that's okay, it. Doing it great. All right. <laughs> I'm Till the other kids knock him down. <laughs> The plans that we made. The plans that we made. That would be great if you didn't stop. You gotta keep singing this. Walking in the winter wonderland. What is it then? Pronounce the T. Winter wonderland. Dude, I'm foreign. That's my man. I told him everything he knows. That's excellent. That's excellent. When it snows, ain't it thrilling? No, your nose gets a chilling. <laughs> to face unafraid the plans <laughs> uh, I hope you guys enjoy our Christmas special. Golden. Right, you with that, Mark? Go yeah. Oh! Uh, oh, man. Elves are shoddy crafts. Do you know who makes the Honda Pilot, Odyssey, and CRV? Real human beings with the dedication and quality. And right now is the perfect time to get a great deal on any one of these babies. You don't build the most durable, longest-lasting line of cars in their class with weak little elf hands. How long have you been here? See, small is good. Got a great deal like this at your Honda dealer today.